Hi, it's uh, Ed here. So I've got the box of the pressing of the 130R album. So basically, I'm, I'm, I'm Ed Box and I'm going to open a box of CDs. There you go. So this has taken quite a lot of uh, work. This started actually in April 2020. At the beginning of lockdown, I started uh, writing songs using a computer program called Guitar Pro. And I typed in all the riffs and bits and bobs by hand and then played along to the sort of computer tracks I'd done uh, in order to uh, come up with lyrics and so on. And then I kind of had the idea, okay, maybe my mate Mick Robson might be able to record this because he was recording at home using like a really cool Yamaha drum gizmo. He'd be able to explain it better than me. And of course, as our good mate Neil Luff, who's an expert engineer. So initial recordings, we actually tried doing Teams, Microsoft Teams at one point because we couldn't go over each other's houses which was a lot of fun, but eventually we sort of came up with a way to kind of transfer stuff and then go over in person when lockdown restrictions got lifted more. So the only final part of the jigsaw was basically, Neil suggested bringing in the singer from his band, Frederick Gorilla, uh, Ian Humphrey, and if you want to try out some vocals, and he's awesome, so he did most of the vocals. And there was also, there's a lot of people playing on this extra guitar solos from uh, Rich Weirs, Pete Thompson, Owen Edwards, uh, and um, Guy Laverick who's also done some rhythm guitar um, and I'm missing someone else who's done a solo, Nick Andrew, actually Nick was the first person to lay a guitar solo down on this. But anyway, let's open it up, so I also haven't got a big pressing on this because, you know, it's more streaming now, but we'll come to uh, if people want to get one physical in a sec, but some Let's have a look at here, it might be an absolute catastrophe. I have had catastrophes with CD pressings. The first CD was ever part of making. The covers didn't turn up on time. Uh, so we ended up doing our launch gig with a CD with no cover. And we had to post the CD covers out. Never quite recovered from that, but anyway. Right. Uh, here it is. Artwork, front cover artwork, there we go, by Pete Thompson. My good mate Pete Thompson, yeah? Okay, and then we're going in close, we're going in close, there we go. And the back tray design, Bleater by Gary Foley. Uh, and the spine by Gary Foley. Let's, um, let's open it up. Some people ask, what is the 130R? And motor racing enthusiasts will know. The 130R is the most challenging corner at the Suzuka track in Japan. So in Formula One, if you watch the Formula One highlights or Formula One, they will mention the 130R, but the origin of the name of the band is actually a song I wrote uh, back in 2000. I recorded the song, well, it was supposed to be called 130R, but I called it 190R because I'd misheard what the corner was. Later on, I realised I got the title, so I renamed it the 130R, the song 130R, when I did my Plectrum Head album. This is pretty cool. There we go, right, let's open it up. <gasps> okay, so here's the disc. There we go, with designed by Gary Foley, with Pete Thompson's logo. Then we've got the inner thing, which is uh, taking some artwork by Trev's story, and Gary Foley's developed that. And then let's open the booklet. Um, like so. And it's just, just a simple fold out, and we've got a cool piece of vector art by Trev's story there. Um, of uh, we've actually used a, an outline of a very famous uh, dashboard um, by an Italian car firm there. Okay, so we've got a we've just got a small press in these hundreds. Obviously, it's going to be available on all the streaming services. Uh, obviously, principally Spotify, Deezer, Tidal, Apple, which is a popular one, Amazon, and various other ones, and also on YouTube. Um, but if you're interested in a physical copy, um, if you see me walking down the street and you go, Ed, can I have a copy of CD? I will produce one out and you pay me a tenner, you can have one. If you need it posting out, it'll be uh, 11 95 That's including posting and packaging, obviously second class. Got to buy a jiffy bag, so there you go. Uh, sending it abroad, not sure yet. I'd imagine the postage would be uh, a bit more, more like um, sort of uh, 14 quid or something like that with the posting and packaging. Okay, so there we are, that is the 130R uh, CD, um, it comes out November the 18th, uh, uh, physically and on all streaming things, and um, if you like the, the sound of what you've heard so far, please 
purchase a copy or stream the hell out of it and I'll see you again later. Thank you very much.